So, uh, yeah. Guess who's not dead? <laughs> Hey guys, it's Selfie Summer Productions here, and welcome to another video! That feels so good to say, you have no, no idea! So, uh, yeah, I'm not dead, believe it or not. I thought I myself was too! I'm joking, I didn't almost die, don't, don't take that the wrong way. So if you want to skip my long reasoning on to why I was gone, just that time right there, skip to that. Okay, okay. This is so weird to do again. <laughs> I have uh, missed this to no end. So basically, why the hell were you gone for? How long is it now? Uh, let me check. Holy, holy God. Oh. Okay, so um, there's my last upload, as you see on the screen right now. <laughs> it's been that long since I uploaded this channel. Holy crap. So yeah, the reason I have been gone for that long is because, um, first off, school started. We all know how wonderful school is, and I am now a junior. I am halfway past junior year, but, you know, I turned eight- I not 18. Thank God not 18 yet. I turned 17, and that means more responsibilities, including a job. It's not fun, I can tell you that much. And I had problems with said job. Ugh, we're not getting into it. It's, it's an entire mess. Anyway, I also had physical therapy at one point for a problem that I've had for years. But because I started jobbing, it started showing up more and more. So, you know, fun. And, um, of course, the reason why I always take long on everything. Procrastination mixed with writer's block. It's a fun, fun, fun combination. So yeah, that's why I've been not that long. I'll be honest, like, my entire motivation just kind of went down the train because I had so many other projects, so many other things to do, and it was driving me insane. And then, of course, my house was usually, uh, really loud and really hard to film because my room has literally no soundproofing so that's fun but you know finally here we are like that again that many months later <laughs> and i'm back i hope and pray that it will never ever take that long to get another video out also um I got a lot of new LPS, and I'll probably make a video showing just how many new LPS. My poor bank account is suffering. Okay, so, uh, for those of you who've skipped to this part, this is because this is to do with Cheryl the Foster. Um, I started filming a bit ago, and the entire set collapsed on me because I was using something that was just completely useless and unnecessary. So because of that, some of the sh sets for the bedrooms and such and Cheryl the Foster will be changed. Other than that, it is mainly the same, same characters, same uh, LPS. I didn't change any of that, so, you know, it's not huge. But anyway, um, please enjoy the video. This took too long to make. Two weeks, to be honest with you, did this take to make. But you know what? I'm back and hopefully I stay back and don't lose myself once again. Anyway, I hope you enjoy! Bye! Well, could've been worse. Could've called home because I was tardy. <sighs> okay, detention. Fun in there. No video games. No nothing. Maybe since I have a fit till they get here. Well, let's hope this goes well.
doing here? Well, straight to the point, you see? I have something for you. Um, okay. What? Why? You're giving this to me? Like, just giving it no reason other than... Why? <laughs> Cheryl, it is, looks so boring in this room. I mean, you don't even have, like, a basic TV. I figured, since I'm going out with my friends, that I don't really need a laptop. What and why not give it to someone who does need it? Also, I know we haven't been very hospitable, but we are happy to have you here. I know it doesn't seem like it, but we really are. So, I guess considering an housewarming gift, uh, about almost a month now, late, but better late than never. Also, don't worry about password or anything. Any sensitive info that I have on there, which isn't much to be honest with you, it's um, locked away with the password. Password again in the laptop is just Cheryl1, so that'll be pretty easy to remember, I feel. Have fun with it, but practice basic safety. Internet rules, please. Well, anyway, I better get going. They should be on their way soon. Wait. Hmm? Uh. Thanks, Jennifer. <laughs> You're welcome, Cheryl. Jeez, it takes forever. What the hell is that? Isn't she beautiful? Do you come to school with that thing? What kind of question is that? Of course I do. Get in. We are not going in any sort of freeways with this, are we? Oh, come on. Stop being a wuss. It's so... Oh my god, it's just a van, it's for hanging out and chilling out. It looks like a f***ing ice cream truck. Whoa, Missy, watch your language there. I'm going to kill you. Ah, <laughs> uh, come on. You'll love it. It's got cool air conditioning, it's got seats at the top, it's just... <sighs> Let's get a car before someone notices you're my friend. Wow, harsh much? Shut up. Alright, alright, I'm in, let's go. Are you buckled in? Shut up and go! <laughs> uh, this is funny. Jeez, <sighs> it takes forever. Oh, I take forever, do I, Cheryl? <laughs> you freaking jerk, you scared me. Sorry. Well, what'd you call me over here for? You're about to say, come on, you'll never ever believe this. Huh? Wait, Cheryl, wait up. Come on, slowpoke. <laughs> Jeez. Holy crap, Cheryl, this room doesn't fit you at all. <laughs> I know, right? And what's with the furniture in here? There's one, barely any. And two, the furniture they do have doesn't even match the freaking room. Almost like they went and bought it, but right before it got there, so they're like, oh no, it's not firmly furnished. <laughs> Let's be honest, that's what most foster parents do. Yeah, wait, 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 wait. One of them trusted you enough to give you a laptop? I know, right? I was so, so surprised. Look. <gasps> Yo, Cheryl, we can play so many games on here. I know, but... Anyway, why did she give it to you? Honestly, Gek, I, I don't know. She just kind of said it must be boring in here and gave it to me. Wait, who? Um, Cheryl. She's the second oldest, I think. The oldest girl, though. Wow. I've never seen that. <laughs> me neither. Hey, maybe this place isn't so bad. <laughs> Tell me about it. Well, enough talking. 
Well, enough talking. There are so many computer games I've wanted to play for God knows how long, and now we finally can. Oh, hell yeah, let's get to it. There's only one thing they could be playing with. Jen's laptop. That little shit. She knew Jennifer wasn't gonna be here. So how the hell would she know she'd take your laptop? <sighs> Mom and Dad are gonna be pissed about this, like I am. <sighs> Thanks guys. Now please, please get off my lawn before someone knows I'm associated with you. Oh, ouch. Ha, huh, at least you don't have to go another three miles. <laughs> Bye, you two. It was really fun. Glad we finally got to play Paulus. Oh, you know it, sweetie. Alright, see ya. Bye, Jen. Bye, guys. <sighs> I hate and love those crackheads. <laughs> Again. Show, this is completely, absolutely unacceptable. I cannot believe you would dare do this. I, I, I swear, she gave it to me. She did. I, I'm not lying. It, it's true. <laughs> You're right. She doesn't trust anyone with her laptop. You think she trusts you, of all people? Come on. She did get it from me. She's telling you the truth and you won't freaking accept it. Wh huh? Why the hell would you give her your lap? Oh, I don't know, because she doesn't have anything to do in that stupid freaking room. No books, no games, not even one book. Jennifer Wright, that is very unappropriate. No! Don't first and last name me over something that is a long, long time coming. All, all of us have done since Cheryl's been here is ridicule and blame. How the hell do you think she feels when she feels like she's the reason all this fighting is occurring, but shouldn't be happening in the damn first place? Looking at you, Obsidian. You keep blaming her for things that are way, way out of her control. And way off anyone's control even, except for you, you, and you. The reason you guys are like, oh, she's the reason this is happening, this is happening, this is happening. Because you weren't ready. Simple and plain. We should have been more careful, and we should have been more preparing, and we should have been more open. But because we're not, because you all can't get over your own freaking egos, look where we are now. But you know what? I'm fucking sick of it. I am sick of bo all of your bullshit, especially you. She deserves more than just an apology from every single one of you. And me. Don't think I'm saying I'm innocent in this. I'm not. But at least I'm actually standing up for the poor girl. The only thing she's done since being here is stand up for herself when you're pointing the blame on something that she has no idea even about. I'm tired and sick of the attitude and the disrespect and the rudeness between all of us and either it stops or this is gonna be a very very common thing of me putting you in your just gonna have my laptop for however long i feel it is because i make the payments on it and you know what i trust her way Way more than I trust you now, Obsidian. What? You have slung since this whole thing started lost my trust. I don't even feel like I know any of you anymore. Come on, Cheryl. She 
She's right. She's right, sweetie. We, we, we just as freaking assumed she did because she's a foster kid. And plus, she knew she was going and none of us would take it. Sweetie. No. Mom, she's completely in the wrong to say we were wrong assuming she stole it. Listen, we should have asked, and she was trying to tell us the damn truth. We shouldn't have assumed she was lying to us. Ugh. Obsidian, to your room. What? Oh, to your rooms, dear. We need to think, and you need to have a long thinking yourself. We are all in the wrong. She's right. Yeah, she is right. We need to stop this. <sighs> and until you get your act together, this ain't gonna end. It's gonna continue for a long ass time. She's- he's right. Now, sweetie, go to your- Don't f call me sweetie. Obsidian! No! She can cuss all she want, but I can't. I'm done with everything. I'm just trying to- Stop with the pretending you're trying to protect us! Come on, she's literally just a kid! A kid. Don't pretend you don't know exactly why dad why we both know just how much damage kids can cause what is he talking about sweetie nothing nothing let's just he's just overreacting come on let's let's go talk uh, all, all, all right I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry that they yelled at you for something that had nothing, nothing to do with you and they wouldn't even let you explain yourself. <laughs> it's fine. I'm pretty used to being assumed for it. But it's not, Cheryl. It is not ever okay to assume something from someone who is in a situation that they never truly meant to be in. What if you're a foster kid? That doesn't mean anything about you as a person. And I'm sorry it's they're not seeing that. That just because you're in a situation that you can't really control, they automatically assume stuff. That shouldn't be how it goes at all. And I'm so, so, so sorry that it took this long for me to stand up for you. You deserved it a long, long time ago. Um, thanks, Jennifer. No problem, Cheryl. Well, I'm offering my paw for a reason. I will always protect you, okay?
Straight to the point, I see. Well, oh, come on. You're giving this to me? Like, just giving it for... Can you stop it up banging? The password to get into the laptop is simply just... God damn it. Just shut up. Let's hurry up and get in before someone knows you're my friend. Ah, god damn it. Ah, oh, come on. I forgot I was right here. Whoopsies. Sorry, Nick. Is it really that hard to grab a freaking laptop? And he's not in frame again! Oh my god. Stop twisting your damn body. We get it, you're flexible. Oh my god. Girl, you did it! Congratulations! You managed to pick up a freaking laptop from your brother. Wonderful! How great are you? <gasps>